Hey Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. And I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out how does your person currently feel about you. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me. Scorpio, how does Scorpio's person currently feel about Scorpio? I'll take it. Please show me more. I feel you're very serious right now, Scorpio, with them. Uh, just being very stern, very strict here with the King of Swords. Perhaps uh, some of you, maybe you're separated from this person, but for some of you, maybe you're going through some issues with this person, okay? Or not talking to each other, either once in reverse. Either they feel like both of your com communication uh, have issues or that both of you are not communicating at all, okay? With either ones here in reverse. With the page of cups here in reverse, they feel like maybe you think they're childish or immature or it could go vice versa, okay? So we've got the justice here. So the justice, the king of swords, these two cards seems pretty serious. Um, a very serious energy. They feel like maybe you are very serious right now. Maybe you could have given them some sort, some sort of an ultimatum to either work on themselves with the Eight of Cups, uh, sorry, Eight of Pentacles here. But Eight of Pentacles could also indicate them perhaps feeling that they need to, or that I would say they want to work on this connection, okay? Take the connection to the next level with the Justice here. Justice indicates marriage, okay? But this could, Justice also could indicate uh, something something official, okay, something official, black and white, something legal. So I feel like Scorpio right now, they feel like maybe you are working right now, you're very busy working, or that they are very busy working on themselves towards being serious, uh, towards taking the relationship to the next level. So eight, four of pentacles is right here. So your person feels like they need to hold on tight to this connection, okay? And I feel like with the Six of Wands, they may be working towards wanting to win you back, okay? For me, Six of Wands is going, uh, it's like coming back from a war, okay, but winning, okay? So Ten of Cups is right here. Your person definitely feels like you are the person for them that they want to be with long term. Uh, but Four of Pentacles also could indicate them not actually saying it, but they're quietly working towards it, okay? And King of Swords here indicates them feeling that maybe this is you or, may, or maybe this is them, okay? Because this actually, um, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy could be dealing with any of these energies, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, okay? Can also be somebody like you or Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. But I feel like Scorpio person is very serious in regards to you, okay? I do sense them wanting to plan something, uh, strategizing something here with the King of Swords uh, to move forward. Uh, to win you back or to make sure that this connection is successful or will become successful okay and we've got the king of wands here so it could be dealing with an aries sagittarius leo scorpio person definitely um desires you okay very passionate about you i do sense them wanting to take actions towards you and they want to make something happen between two of you with a magician here okay hmm you know, the eight of wands here in reverse could also indicate somebody being very cold to somebody when they communicate or not showing much affection. I don't know if they feel this is you or this is them, okay? Just take what resonates with you. None of cups is right here, so they do have feelings for you. If there's another choice, I feel like they're going to choose you because the lovers could indicate a choice here. They feel like um, they would like to choose you, okay? Yep. Definitely choosing you. And Page of Swords is right here. However, they either are spying on you or that they feel you're spying on them, okay? Like not trusting in some way, shape or form. Four Swords, four swords right here. This may indicate them feeling that maybe it's either them uh, kind of taking a break, keeping quiet while spying on you or thinking that you are spying on them, uh, quietly spying on them. Again, hmm. Because Page Swords is actually a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. If you are dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, they could be spying on you, okay? Again, who knows? Uh, we all have all many, many signs in our chart. 
So, but four swords, this could indicate a separation or both of you are on a break, okay? Because the lovers is also in reverse. So these two cards may indicate both of you either are taking a break or separated right now, okay? Some of you are not separated. I feel, usually I feel very strongly if it's like this connection are com uh, is completely separated. But in this case, Scorpio, for some of you, I feel like just going through some issues, very, very small issue. Uh, but some of you are separated from this person. Okay, now I'm seeing the Ten of Swords here in reverse. Two of Wands in reverse. They feel like maybe you could have made a choice or that they could have made a choice to... Uh, mm. With the Ten of Swords here in reverse, I feel like they're making a choice to remove the swords off of your back, wanting to make things right with you. Uh, perhaps, you know, there's a separation between the two of you. For some of you, if separated, then they don't want it to end. I don't see them wanting to end this connection. I see them feeling very positive and definitely planning, strategizing in returning to you or making things right for you, okay? Treat you fairly with the just, justice card here. We've got the hangman here in reverse. This definitely indicates them seeing things in a different perspective. Again, if they've got any other options with the seven of cups or if it's not about options, if it's about them feeling confused, they have decided they know you are definitely the one for them okay they feel like they want to offer you love but that they feel also at the same time you may be resisting it or that you don't trust them so hmm. four of cups in reverse so okay so both of you are most likely separated or going through some issues four of cups in reverse for me indicates somebody feeling that they are um, this is a missed opportunity. Either your person feels that you are a missed opportunity or that they don't want to miss the opportunity uh, being with you and building something with you. You know, Ten of Cups is a completion number, complete their life with you. To me, this has something to do with long-term long -term connection, building a family together, being just happily ever, being with each other happily ever after, okay? Four Pentacles, they're definitely still holding on to this connection. I feel like, mm, I feel like they're very attracted to you, Scorpio, still. I feel like they want you, that's for sure, very serious. They know, they know that you are the one that they, that they want to be with and they want to make it happen with a magician here by hook or by crook. All right, Scorpio, this is your reading. Hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with a playlist on the screen right now. This is the playlist from my second vlog channel if you're interested to check it out. And also, I'm open for personal readings. If you guys would like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And Scorpio, I post your videos almost every single day. Uh, if you would like to notify every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. All right, take care, Scorpio. Bye.